ever since I became XWA Heavyweight Champion, I've realized after 10 years, 10 years of being held back, 10 years of having to climb that ladder, 10 years of having to do all the chasing, I don't have to anymore. Because now I'm the man, because this says I am. And you see, the problem we have now is I know the fans are thinking, what now for Johnny Fear? What's gonna motivate him? It's the simple fact that this right here, this symbolizes who is the best. And right now, that is exactly what I am, the best. And I don't give a damn who it is at Gold Rush. Anyone can win that match. Anyone can become number one contender. But you know what? This title here, this is going nowhere. Because as long as I want this, more than anyone else, it's not going anywhere. Because right now there is not a person walking the face of this earth who wants this more than I do. Now, on February the 4th, at the Carlton, I'm against Nathan Cruz. Now Nathan, at first I had a problem because as far as I was concerned, I wanted to wrestle sticks because he is the rightful number one contender. But at the end of the day, I don't give a damn. But then I thought, Nathan, you're actually the perfect opponent for me right now. Because you see, I was reading the build up to our match, Nathan. And I quote, we have the champion, the power and the aggression of the champion against the all round skills of the challenger, Nathan Cruz. That makes me sound one dimensional. There is a hell of a lot more to Johnny Fear than power and aggression. And on February the 4th, Nathan, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna make you an example. You are first on my list. I'm gonna surprise everyone because I am a wrestler and that is exactly what I'm gonna prove. Now, Gold Rush Rumble itself, anyone can win that, but I don't give a damn who it is. You know, Sticks, you do deserve to be number one contender. And if you win that match, that is exactly what you'll be. But understand this, if you do, sooner or later, our paths will cross and it will be Johnny Fear who ends the stick streak. Or maybe it could be Joey Hayes who wins the Rumble. Joey, you've been in the XWA a long time, but you have not once, not once, had a shot at this. Or maybe Sam Slam himself, Sam, since you've stepped down as 50% owner of the company, there's nothing stopping you going to this and I know you want this, Sam. You see, I've beaten you once, you've beaten me once. So if you ever want that rubber match, if you ever want a shot at this, I'm not hard to find, I'll be waiting. But understand, anyone, I don't care who it is, from now until I lose this, this title is staying around my waist because there is not one person who wants this more than I want it. So the simple fact is, if you think, if you think that I am lying, if you think that I'm just talking a load of crap, then simply step inside that ring and face your fear.